Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and with the US Open just around the corner, we have some big names that have pulled out, some Grand Slam champions that have pulled out over the last couple of days. Let's go have a look at the list for the WTA, because some big names have just pulled out in the last 24 hours. All right, starting with the women's side of things, and the first player to pull out is Sophia Kennan, the Australian Open champion from last year. She's actually pulled out after testing positive to COVID-19, so she won't be playing this year. We have Sigamon. She's pulled out because of a knee injury that she's had for the last couple of weeks. The Romanian Teague, she's pulled out because of a back injury. Wong has also pulled out due to a scheduling change, so she couldn't schedule in the US Open. Serena Williams, the biggest name for the WTA, not playing in the 2021 US Open. Of course, made the semifinals last year, the final the year before. She's pulled out with a hamstring injury, so we haven't seen Serena since Wimbledon when she got injured at Wimbledon. We won't be seeing her for some time yet. And her sister Venus has also pulled out of the US Open due to a leg injury that she got last week in Chicago. Zhang has also pulled out for unknown reasons reasons and also zoo pulled out as well again for unknown reasons not sure if it's injury or if it's just a scheduling change as well taking a look at the men's side of the tournament and again we've got some really big names who've pulled out starting with Bedene, who's actually pulled out just for feeling unwell he did get COVID a couple of months ago so maybe still recovering from that borna Choric, who hasn't been on tour for a long long time he's pulled out of another major tournament due to his right shoulder injury and like Choric, edmund kyle edmund he's pulled out as well of another major tournament due to a persistent knee injury he's been battling for the last couple of years. Speaking of knee injuries, Roger Federer, he's pulled out one of the biggest names on the men's side to not be playing the US Open this year. Out with that right knee injury, getting surgery, of course. And Rafa Nadal, the left foot has come back to hurt him again. Been a constant throughout his career, the foot injuries. He is not playing the US Open and, of course, not playing for the rest of the year. Milos Raonic hasn't played for a while. He has pulled out with a leg injury. So we haven't seen Milos for what seems like forever, almost all year. So he's also pulled out of the US Open this year. Dominic Team, the defending champion, he has pulled out with a wrist injury. Of course, injured that during the grass court season a couple of months ago, so he won't be playing due to the right wrist. And Stan Wawrinka, he has also got a foot injury, a left foot injury that he actually got surgery on a couple of months ago, so he is still in rehab trying to get better, but won't be playing the US Open this year. So there it is, the massive names that have pulled out. It was the men's side of things that were falling apart pretty early, but in the last couple of days, we have some massive, massive names not playing with Serena and Venus not playing, and of course, Sophia Kennan, she's a Grand Slam champion too, and she won't be playing in this year's US Open. Let me know down in the comments below, who are you going to miss the most out of these massive names? Because like I said, Grand Slam champions all around, former champions of the US Open as well. Don't forget, Venus, Serena, Team, Vavrinka, and then of course the other two goats with Federer and Nadal. They've all won this tournament before, and we're not going to see any of them this year. So let me know down in the comments below, who are you most disappointed about not seeing this year? So the US Open, it's only a week away, but some massive names are dropping out late.